Well, this morning there is a run that is starting off another day of peaceful demonstrations in Atlanta. CBS 46's Barmel Lyons is live on the 17th Street Bridge right near Atlantic Station, and that is where people are running 8.46 miles for justice and equality. Barmel, we can see the group of runners that's gathered behind you. That's right, Megan. They have started to come in, and you can see there's a little over 100 people here joining the Atlanta running community right now. They're uniting to honor George Floyd and bring awareness to the injustice and equality that people face every day. Now, they're running 8.46 miles to represent the 8 minutes and 46 seconds that George Floyd had his neck crushed by the former members of the Minneapolis Police Department. I want to take our attention over to the organizers of this event. Right over here, we have Shannon and Kenny. Hi. How hey, are how, you? how are you? Good morning. Good morning. Hello. How's it going? Good morning. Now, you guys organized this so quickly. I mean, you put it together. Wait, Wednesday, right? Wednesday. Wednesday, we put it together, and by uh, Thursday evening, we had marketing out. Wow. Yep. Wow, that's awesome. Now, tell me the purpose of having everybody here. Of course, it's in honor of George Floyd, but yeah. the 8.46 seconds yeah. that you guys are running today. Right, yeah, so these 8.4 seconds, it's representing uh, that it's a moment of George Floyd's neck being crushed, not being kneeled on, being crushed. Uh, and we want to bring recognition to the, the injustice in the community um, and things that really needs to change the systematic uh, racism. Uh, and instead of, you know, putting all this money into the police force, put it into education, put it into fixing things around the community that we, we really need. Give it to matters that really can make a difference in here in the Atlanta community. Definitely, Shannon. And I see you have a shirt right here that says not a suspect. I mean, that speaks volumes, Kenny. Tell me a little bit about that. Well, uh, it's pretty much a shirt to show that we're not suspects. We're not out of place. Um, it's pretty much we got it for Ahmaud Arbery, but I mean, as you've seen with everything that's going on, it's pretty, it's pretty fitting. Uh, I'm not, I'm not in the wrong place. I'm not where I'm not supposed to be. I don't have to explain myself to nobody to be nowhere. So, you know, we're, we're supposed to be where we're supposed to be and we're making it happen. Now that you guys put this together Wednesday and you see all these runners out here running for justice, how does this make you feel right now? I love it. I mean, uh, the running community is kind of the cross section of everything. At, look, if you look at everybody, we got a melting pot out here, just like our country. And it shows how important this is to everybody. Uh, black, white, you know, uh, LGBTQ, everybody. We're all together in this, you know, we're all trying to end uh, the injustice. Uh, I mean, I love it. Yeah. Like, this was my heart. Like, just seeing everybody coming out, I was just like, wow. It, it, it warms my heart. It makes me feel good that, you know, we're coming together for, for a common cause, and, and it feels good. Awesome. Now, this is just one of many peaceful protests that we've seen throughout the weeks and throughout the days. And if you can't run 8.46 miles, what would you advocate for real quick? Well, Let me know. So with this run, we also wanted to make sure it was inclusive of everyone. Mm -hmm. So if you, we made it at 4.23 uh, loop. So if you only got 4.23 uh, miles in you, you can do that. You can walk, you can run, you can jog. However it is that you get around, we made it so that it's inclusive of everyone. Perfect. So it's inclusive. If you can't get all the way for that running, you can run half of it, all right? That is a look at what we got. Again, just check out those runners. In Atlanta, I'm Barma Lyons, CBS 46 News. Yep, we know Atlanta's running community is a passionate one. Great to see that turnout today, Bramel. Thank you. We'll check in in just a little bit.